Imagine a spacecraft launched over 45 years ago, now drifting over 24 billion kilometers away from Earth. It's a beacon of human ingenuity, but recently, it's been sending signals that defy explanation. Are we on the brink of losing contact with Voyager 1? Or is there a more mysterious force at play? Join us as we delve into the perplexing anomalies of this legendary explorer. After the launch was confirmed and removed, early estimates warned of collecting only blurry photos. NASA's Voyager 1, now more than 45 years old and 24 billion kilometers from Earth, served as a reminder of the humility of science by adapting a spacecraft. In this study, we explore the mystery surrounding Voyager 1's recent anomalies. Are we losing contact? which means the probe's death. Is it possible that an alien animal is interfering with the probe? Join us on a journey through space to analyze strange signals and discover the true state of the legendary explorer Voyager 1. To understand the significance of Voyager 1's problem, we must first recognize its monumental nature. Launched in 1977, the mission was supposed to last only five years, but it defied all expectations. Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 exceeded expectations by delivering important scientific information from the outskirts of our solar system for nearly four decades. They were originally tasked with exploring Jupiter and Saturn, but succeeded beyond their original goals. In August 2012, Voyager 1 entered interstellar space after 35 years of operation, marking a milestone in space exploration. NASA confirmed this achievement in 2013. Voyager 2 provided close-up views of Uranus and Neptune. Voyager 1, the most distant man-made spacecraft from Earth, changed our understanding of space by showing the interaction between the solar wind and the interstellar medium and the nature of the heliosphere. Voyager 1's journey left a lasting legacy of space exploration. Scientists predict that the first contact with extraterrestrial life may occur in 2029, and messages will reach intelligent life forms as early as 2022. This contact marks an important milestone in human history, raising interest in the aftermath and highlighting the endurance of Voyager 1. The longevity of the device is remarkable because it can withstand harsh conditions such as radiation, extreme temperatures, and the threat of micrometeoroids. Voyager 1's 46-year journey highlights the human spirit of design and exploration, the spacecraft's longevity is due to its robust structure, designed to withstand cosmic radiation, extremes of heat and cold, and space rocks. The probe's longevity is due to its reliable power source, nuclear batteries, sometimes called radioisotope thermal generators, RTG. They use the heat generated by the decay of plutonium to generate electricity. RTGs were the core of Voyager 1's propulsion system for nearly four decades. Although their power has been reduced by radioactive decay, they continue to operate all the scientific instruments on board. Voyager 1 is more than just a spacecraft. It is an intelligent researcher equipped with scientific tools like a Swiss Army knife. Voyager 1 carries the Cosmic Ray Subsystem, CRS, a high-powered antenna and imaging science subsystem consisting of the Infrared Interferometer and Spectrometer, IRISO, Low Energy Charge Particle, LECP, magnetometer, MAG, and optical calibration, OOC, photopolarimetric system, PPS, planetary radio astronomy, PRA, plasma science, PLS, and plasma wave subsystem, PWS, are present. The ship also has radioisotope thermal generators, RTG, and ultraviolet spectrometers. These instruments are more than just decorative elements. They perform important functions. Voyager 1's close-up images reveal details of the giant planets and their moons, including Jupiter's clouds, wild winds, and storms. It discovered a volcano on Jupiter's moon Io. Saturn rings were more than beautiful jewelry with unique twists, turns, and surfaces. They offered a variety of rings. But it's more than just aesthetics. These instruments studied cosmic rays, charged particles, magnetic fields, and plasma waves. Meanwhile, Voyager 1 carries a message from Earth to the unknown. The Golden Disk is humanity's unique attempt to contact all the aliens they have encountered on their endless journey. 
The golden record is a unique artifact consisting of a 12-inch gilded copper plate with carefully selected sounds and images that represent the diversity of the country's life and culture. This disc contains 116 images and a symphony of sounds that tell the story of our species and planet. It aims to bridge the gap between civilizations separated by space, including music and spoken greetings in 55 languages from around the world, as well as natural sounds such as thunder, birdsong, and haunting sounds. A committee led by the famous astrophysicist Carl Sagan carefully selected each element to represent different cultures and experiences. The golden disc is entrusted to Voyager 1 and its twin, Voyager 2. These travelers can deliver a message from Earth that may be discovered by extraterrestrial life in the distant future. If a sophisticated alien society locates Voyager 1 and finds its golden disk, it would be a historic event in interstellar communication. There are three possible consequences. Extraterrestrial civilizations could use advanced technology to decipher the golden disk, including visual and audio information. Scientists predict that if aliens can travel and communicate between stars, they could send a signal back to Earth by 2029. Alternatively, Voyager 1 could be studied as a historical artifact without intervention. They may wish to respect the principle of non-interference in the development of other civilizations, which has been explored in many science fiction stories. In any case, if there was ever an encounter with aliens, it would be a huge and possibly world-changing event for humanity. Despite its long and faithful service, Voyager 1 recently added an interesting element to its mission. It began transmitting confusing data from the edges of interstellar space, sending NASA engineers into a frenzy. This deviation is caused by an important onboard system known as the Attitude Articulation and Control System, ACS. This system is responsible for measuring, reporting and regulating the position of the spacecraft in the unforgiving space of space, ensuring that its antenna remains pointed at Earth for communication and data transmission. But inexplicably, ACS returns data that contradicts the actual motion and orientation of the spacecraft, as if Voyager 1 is confused and doesn't know its place in the cosmic void. NASA finds this scenario both comforting and confusing. Despite the erroneous data from ACS, Voyager 1 continues to function properly, receiving commands from Earth's mission control and collecting important scientific data from its remote location. The anomaly does not appear to be a spacecraft, and no internal safe systems have been activated to place it in a protective safe state. Interestingly, Voyager 1's transmission signal remains a strong beacon in the void. The high-powered antenna points to the correct planet but the telemetry data produced by ACS seems random or unexplained. Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 project manager Suzanne Dodd sheds light on this confusing scenario. Voyager's mission encountered unexpected challenges, such as spacecraft aging beyond their intended lifespan, traversing interstellar space into uncharted territory. Despite these challenges, the design team remains optimistic about finding a solution. In 2017, Voyager 1 faced a similar challenge when its main thrusters began to wear out. To continue the mission, engineers had to switch to thrusters that had not been used during the spacecraft's planetary missions in 37 years. However, there is a new twist in the story. NASA's genius engineers have identified a problem with Voyager 1. It turns out that the ACS was sending telemetry data to a computer that malfunctioned a long time ago and corrupted the data. Suspecting that this was the culprit, the project manager took a calculated risk by telling ACS repeatedly to send the data to the correct computer. Although engineers are still unsure why the ACS malfunctioned, the anomaly was likely triggered by an incorrect command from another computer on board. If so, that suggests the spacecraft's core problem may lie elsewhere. The team remains committed to finding the root cause, although they do not believe that it presents a serious threat to Voyager's general health. However, they want to better understand Voyager 1's inner workings. However, it is important to understand that Voyager 1's journey through space will eventually come to an end. In fact, the time of this brave explorer is coming to an end. This brings us to the pressing question. How long can NASA's Voyager continue its incredible journey? Before considering how Voyager 1 communicates with us from 24 billion kilometers away, 
it is important to understand the factors that determine how far it can travel before losing contact. Voyager 1 relies on a well-designed radio communication system that efficiently transmits and receives radio waves via three ground stations. When Voyager 1 communicates with Earth, it usually does so via Deep Space Network Channel 18, using either the 2.3 GHz or 8.4 GHz radio frequencies. On the other hand, when we send signals to Voyager, we do so at 2.1 GHz. This complex communication setup allows Voyager 1 to maintain contact with our home planet even as it travels into the vast unknown. Voyager 1's distance, however, means that direct communication with Earth has become increasingly difficult. To deal with this, the spacecraft is equipped with a digital recorder, DTR, capable of storing approximately 67 megabytes of data. This stored data can be sent back to Earth later when communication conditions are more favorable.